implications of demand and supply. What do we mean by applications? We have already studied many aspects of perfect competition. Application here means applying. Applying here means applying to some real market situations. Jo knowledge humne perfect competition mein gain ki hai, agar usko hum real market mein apply karne ki koshish kare hai. So by that we mean applications. There can be large number of applications. You will study when you go to the college, you will study lots of applications. But here, your curriculum, your syllabus confines, is confined only to two applications. One application is maximum price ceiling. What is maximum price ceiling? Sometimes you find that in Aam Bhasha Mein Aap Bulte Hain Controlled Price. To Kya Matlab Hota Hai Aapka Controlled Price? Controlled Price means price fixed by the government. Why should government fix up the price when market is there? Market is going to determine what what should be the price, why should government fix up the price? Government takes action when government finds that equilibrium price is too high for a common man, for a poor man to afford. It may be a grain, wheat, rice, it may be a particular medicine. Nowadays there is a talk of swine flu and you have, you must have learned from newspapers, testing of swine flu used costs from 5000 to 10,000 in different labs. Now finding this too high for a common man. Government has recently fixed Delhi government, particularly I am talking of Delhi government, because uh, they, uh, the price determined is at around 4,500 for the testing of swine flu. What does it mean? No lab can charge more than 4,500 for testing swine flu. Similar price fixation can take place in any other commodity which is consumed on mass scale and in whose case government finds equilibrium price too high. Suppose price of rice is too high. What can government do? Government fix up the minimum, uh, 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 maximum price which should be less than the equilibrium price. So normally maximum ceiling means the maximum limit. Scorm price ceiling both day. Now it is clear if you can say a uh, price ceiling is higher than equilibrium price, what will happen? Or 
then there is no need for uh, making a price ceiling. Price ceiling can be successful only when it is less than equilibrium price. Suppose equilibrium price is rupees 10 and government has fixed 5. What will be the effect? At this price, demand will rise. And what will happen to supply? See, but government can enforce the price, but the government cannot force the producers to produce more. So, at lower price, supply will fall. Producer, agar usko 10 rupay do, to wo jada supply karega. Agar usse 5 rupay do, to wo kam supply karega. That is the law of supply. Consumer, 10 rupay par kam demand karega, 5 rupay par jada demand karega. So, demand rises, supply falls and this leads to, you can say, excess demand and excess demand through, you know that, it, it, it uh, uh, leads to, uh, here price can't rise because there is a ceiling, this leads to shortage. अक्सर ये टर्म भी आप इस्तेमाल करते हैं इस इस, इस कमोडिटी की शॉर्टेज है बाजार में बाजार में शॉर्टेज है ये टर्म भी आप इस्तेमाल करते हैं तो शॉर्टेज का मतलब क्या होता है कि जिस प्राइस पर ये चीज बिक रही है उस पर डिमांड ज्यादा है और सप्लाई बहुत कम है इसलिए उसकी शॉर्टेज है सो व्हाट इज द इफेक्ट ऑफ Maximum price ceiling. The effect is before you. Ultimate effect is shortage. Shortage of the good on which the price ceiling has been fixed. The effect actually doesn't stop here. Shortage means consumers will not be able to get all the quantity they want to buy. So, what will consumer do? It will lead to illegal practices. Illegal practices. Kya illegal practice? Consumer is in dire need of the thing. He is not getting it. So, he will illegally offer to the seller, okay, you you, you charge from me 6 rupees, you charge from me 7 rupees, but give me this commodity. You give me the bill of only 5 rupees, but you may charge 6 rupees, you may charge 7 rupees. What do you call in real life? This is called black marketing. So, what is the effect of shortage? Shortage leads to black marketing. A black marketing will depend kitni hogi. It will all depend how many producers are dishonest, how many producers are honest. Unpa depend karega ki black marketing kitni hogi. But it is likely to be a black marketing. So there are two effects. One, shortage. Second, black marketing. एग्जाम में जो क्वेश्चंस की उम्मीद की जाती है वो ये है व्हाट आर द लाइकली इफेक्ट्स ऑफ मैक्सिमम प्राइस सीलिंग द इफेक्ट्स पोर्शन स्टॉप्स हियर इट इज इट विल लीड टू शॉर्टेज एंड इट शॉर्टेज इन टर्न विल लीड टू ब्लैक मार्केटिंग ये ऐसा चलेगा if you wish, you can add another line. That maximum price ceiling, agar government rationing kar de, open market ne rationing, jis ki aksar government karti hai, jis chiz ki kiemat kam karti hai government, uski rationing bhi kar deti hai, that every month you are going to get 10 kilo of rice, 20 kilo of rice, 30 kilos of rice, whatever, the quantity fixed, then this black marketing can be avoided. 
that's all and normally when government make fixes a maximum price ceiling along with that they also fix up they uh, uh, they also fix up the maximum quantity a consumer can buy so that whatever little quantity is available with the producers it can be distributed equally among all the consumers having understood how what does it mean and what does it lead to we can show it on the diagram as well diagram is clear x y price quantity demand supply price quantity ये इक्विलिब्रियम दिस इज इक्विलिब्रियम क्वांटिटी इक्विलिब्रियम प्राइस इफ गवर्नमेंट डजेंट मेक डजेंट फिक्स अप एनी मैक्सिमम प्राइस देन दिस इज द प्राइस व्हिच इज गोइंग टू प्रिवेल इन द मार्केट गवर्नमेंट फाइंड्स इट टू हाई फॉर द कंज्यूमर्स सो गवर्नमेंट फिक्सेस अप लेट अस से ए लोअर प्राइस से पी1 सो this then becomes the ceiling this then becomes the maximum price a producer can charge now keeping in mind the market position at this price producers will like to sell only p1 s1 say this quantity ओके ओवन बट कंज्यूमर्स आर विलिंग टू बाय एट दिस प्राइस डी वन सो द डिमांड एट दिस प्राइस इज पी वन एस वन पी वन डी वन वाइल सप्लाई इज पी वन एस वन सो दिस दिस पोर्शन विल रिमेन अनफुलफिल्ड देन दिस बिकम्स what is the shortage shortage is s1 d1 or which is equal to same thing as q1 q2 and this shortage as we have shown will lead to black marketing the price will rise higher and it can go up to this point we are not going to show that this is enough for the examination purposes so if you are if you are asked to explain this these effects with the help of diagram then first you explain what i have already explained to you and then draw the diagram after this we come to there is another ceiling which is <coughs> minimum minimum price ceiling there is another name for this price floor floor ka matlab hai upper limit sorry lower limit isse niche nahi ja sakte price floor in this case opposite happens government finds that equilibrium price is too low maybe for the suppliers who are not able to earn enough to continue supply in that case government may pass an order suppose equilibrium equilibrium price is 10 and government may pass a order for 12 this commodity cannot be sold 
below rupees 12. Halanki such cases are rare. But we will take one realistic case at least. This sometimes happens in case of agriculture. And it happens in a big way. If farmers are left to the market, they may get suppose 15 rupees a kilo for their wheat. Suppose their expenditure is 17 rupees per kilo. So this time they have produced wheat, next time they will not produce wheat. So what can government do? Government fix up a price higher than 15 and say 18. Once again, just fixing the price is not enough. Government has to take some supplementary measures. Uske saath saath government ko kuch aur bhi karna padega. Wo kya hai? Wo hum abhi dekhte hai. So in this case, what do you find? E equilibrium price is lower than price floor. Say, I just give you an example. Say, equilibrium price is 15. I say, price floor is 18. So, what go? So, is pe kya hoga? Demand will come down because at a higher price, consumers are going to demand less. Supply will go up. Farmer will supply more wheat. So, ek taraf demand giregi, ek taraf supply badegi. It will lead to let us say excess supply or that means surplus. Kisano ke paas surplus rahe jayega. They will not be able to sell all they produce if simply only price is fixed. But what is the effect? We have just said one effect is there will be surplus. Jaise aapne kaha tha maximum price ceiling mein shortage. Wo black marketing ki taraf gai thi. So what, what is likely to be the effect of surplus? Maan lije dukandar se kaha bhi tum 18 rupay se kam par nahi bech sakte. Farmer se kaha tum 18 rupay se kam par nahi bech sakte. Farmer kata bhi mera maal to bik nahi raha hai. आप मुझे रसीद 18 की मुझसे ले लो मुझे 18 की रसीद दे दो लेकिन मेरा माल खरीद लो तुम चाहे मुझे 16 दे दो तो उससे क्या होगा यू कैन से इलीगल ट्रेडिंग चालू हो जाएगी जैसे उसमें ब्लैक मार्केटिंग था अब इलीगल ट्रेडिंग चालू हो जाएगी now producers will like to sell their commodity at below the controlled price in a way that it can't be checked. So what situation mein kya hoga? Government when fixes up this price which is normally called support price. Accept support price. Har saal ye fix hoti hai. But simply fixing support price is not enough. Along with government offers that farmers are free to sell any quantity they like.